computing power. Uh, MediaShow 5. MediaShow is the ultimate software application, uh, taking care of uh, video, photos, just by like getting it. You have to organize, enhance, fix, create slideshow, upload, share into Facebook, Flickr, uh, every, everywhere. So we need to convert the video, convert the photo, and greatest technology we develop in this new version is face tagging. Face tagging. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Originally, we think we need we tell people to do video conversion, but now it's not only video. For photos, I have uh, more than 10,000 photos in my notebook. Um, if with media show, you, we can uh, smartly tag each photo, uh, okay. analyze the photo, analyze the face. Okay. So help you grouping your friends into your family, your friends, right. by different faces. Okay. So, so now, yes, yes, yeah. yes. So I'd like to have our uh, PN director Luis to have a cool demo. Oh, have this face face tag. Okay. Yes, sure. Uh, let me show to you uh, what we have done for the innovation of the product. Well, the advantage of the new processor. Uh, so here you see the application in the photo and video and that was fine. Uh, let me start with the photo. So all of that has a lot of uh, photo in here, and it's really hard for you to try to find those that have, for example, uh, certain people together, like me and my wife. So one of the ways traditionally you go from day is to place a new blend here and pick one by one. But now with the new application, we have a smarter way to do it. So it's called take faces. So now you take faces, right? So by taking the take faces, what you does is going to scan through my uh, media library and try to uh, detect all the faces that you see inside the photo. So you see it's running now. So these are the photo in my library. And it's picking up those faces that you see in the photo and try to put them together. Okay. So, uh, and uh, especially in the notice here, you see we are taking full advantage of every uh, core and multi threading. So this is eight cores here, right? Exactly. It's a quad core processor with hyperthreading, so it's eight cores. And all the cores are fully used right now, right? Exactly. Almost 100%. Right. So these are really the big benefits of using these new processors. Uh, you have hundreds of photos that run that all at the same time without weight. And most important here with the new uh, input cover bar of groups, we can also take advantage of that pro every core. Uh, to have an extra lead, an extra performance because we need Yeah, that. it's turbo right now, yeah, that's right. Exactly. So you then get just it's so done. So I have analyzed 144 photo to me on 44 seconds. But next I want to show you that now you put together this photo and the, the problem is thinking these are probably only the same people. So for example, if we take the original, I should there are four people in this photo, and you detect this if you're a little girl and you can take any of these or this or another. So uh, here let me take this, uh, this is actually Emmy. So I type in Emmy. So now the problem now is that now we have Emmy, and that's okay, this is another lady here, and we don't send people, so I will take it. Uh, and then, uh, and uh, let me do the circle. Okay, so at least we do. So once I'm done, uh, and you can see I'm quick to read, uh, uh, take you know, uh, those and other, those photos. Now instead of just browsing by all of them, now I can uh, browse all, every photo that has Emmy in there, or every photo that has my mail in there. Now, most importantly, with this technology, we can do a searching. So, if I want to search photos that have Amy and Manuel together, and now let's say it's found one photo with six media. So, these six photos all have at least Manuel and Amy in there. So, it's right. a great cool, uh, way of automating your photo automatically using the power of the new processor, new architecture, and then saving us a consumer a lot of time when you organize your photo. And last thing I want to mention is that the of the photo, another great thing is that it's a transporting. So, you take my video and my photo and transfer from a portable device on the go. And in, on the Core i7 architecture, you actually are getting more than double the speed of the previous process. Very cool, very cool. Okay, thank you. So, this is available now, right? Yeah. So, we can all Tell go buy one. We can all go buy one today, right? Yes. Core i7 plus Meet the Show. Five. All right, good, good. Well, thank you so much. That was great. That was great. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Nabi. Thank you for all your support. Okay, so that was another example of uh, performance and why performance matters, uh, increasingly so. Um, I think it's pretty clear that as the hardware evolves, the software continues to get better, and there's no limit to what's possible as more and more...